but I actually want you to take a listen to one of the more interesting parts of the conversation with Joe Rogan, where the podcast host really pushed back on some of former President Donald Trump's uh, conspiracies about the 2020 election. Take a listen. What, how do you think you were robbed? Everybody always cuts you off. I'm going to allow... Do. Well, they not only cut you off. Well, what I'd rather do is we'll do it another time, and I would bring in papers that you would not believe. So many different papers. That election was so crooked. It was the most crooked election. Okay, but give me some examples of how. Well, let's start Let's start okay. on the top and the easy ones. Okay. They were supposed to get legislative approval to do the things they did, and they didn't get it. In many cases, they didn't get it. What things? Anything. Legislative they made, approval Like of... for extensions of the voting, for, for, for voting earlier, for this, right. for all different things. By law, they had to get legislative approvals. You don't have to go any further than that. If you take a look at Wisconsin, uh, they virtually admitted that the election was rigged, robbed, and stolen. They wouldn't give access in certain areas to the ballots because the ballots weren't signed. They weren't originals. They were. We could go into this stuff. We could go into the ballots or we could go into the overall. I'll give you another one. Are you going to present well, this well, let me, ever? Uh, 